place you hear. It was good internet, the Black Okage here, aka TBH, and to be honest, I got something on my mind. Y'all ever watch that show Pawn Stars? It gives a great mix of education and entertainment in my opinion, but it's something that just really bothers me about that show. How the hell does Rick and the crew have a plug for everything? Let me ask you a question. How many times have you been watching Pawn Stars and someone will come in with something ultra rare, they'll ask them how much they want for it, and the seller throws out a price, and then Rick says, I got a buddy who knows all about these things. Now for certain things, that makes sense, like cars, guns, jewelry, money, clothes, etc., but nine times out of ten, this is how the show goes. The seller walks into the store and Rick greets them. The seller will say, Hi, my name's Katana and I have a sword that steals the souls of my enemies and locks them inside the sword after I kill them. Then Rick will be like, Well, wow, that's interesting. So how much do you want for it? Then Katana goes, I want one million dollars for it. Then Rick goes, Ooh, that's a steep price. So before I spend that kind of money, let me make a call. See, I got this guy who's an expert in mystical soul stealing katanas who can verify this thing for me. Now, at this point, I'm just sitting on the couch watching this shit like, Oh my fucking god, I'm tripping. You can have Thanos Infinity Gauntlet with all the gems in it, and Rick gonna be like, Let me call my buddies the Guardians of the Galaxy, the Silver Surfer, and the Avengers to verify this for me real quick. It's just shocking to me that nobody questions this shit. I can walk into Rick's pawn shop right now with a Ziploc full of flour and claim it's a kilo of cocaine, and Rick gonna be like, Let me call in Mercy from Overwatch to resurrect Pablo Escobar so he can verify the purity of this brick. I mean, every fuck an episode all i hear is i got a buddy who deals in all the world war one world war two stuff i'm just sitting there watching the show like what oh! I, need to do is I mean seriously think about it most you people don't even have a reliable guy to sell you weed but somehow rick got a reliable everything look i'm not saying his actors on the show i'm just saying well Actually, I don't know what the hell I'm saying. I just felt like venting about something that I noticed about the show. Now, did what I just ran about matter in the grand scheme of things? No, but I appreciate you listening. And since you made it to the end of the video, one would assume that it's something that you liked about it. Even if it was just one thing. Do me a favor and hit the like button. Comment and subscribe. Because those are the three elements that help my channel grow. Hell, I do my part as the content creator, so do yours as the viewer. And like, comment, subscribe, and share this video on your favorite social media platforms. Because if you don't, then I'm going to get fucking triggered. Boy.